here we are continuing this third round for the Zodiac Braves division, hosted by me. That's right, Wiz. Anyways, so to introduce this top team, we have Philly All Day the Lancer, Sobe the Geomancer, Rockstar Leo the Time Mage, and Lulbolt's the Geomancer. Now, for this bottom team, we have Cypira the Infamous Wizard, Fanatic the Monk, Tail the Archer, and Dogisi the Monk. Uh, one note I just want to make compared to the last round, whatever the reason is, I pointed out how like all females were X Zodiac and all males were Y Zodiac, so they all had good compat. I told that to Tactile Goblins, so now males have good compat, uh, male females have best compat, and female female, they have good compat with one another, or, uh, They'll have worse compat, like such as Sir Dash and Bastard Poetry, which will be in uh, the other division. So, yeah, now that I got that out of the way, we're going to pick our random map. And uh, let's go to, uh, I'm thinking uh, the top of Rybane's castle, at, uh, no, the roof, where you see Elmdor and fight him for the first time. A couple things I want to note. I'm going to be playing some music from Rainbow Moon in the M uh, M4A uh, file format. And I'm going to be turning off sound effects when this starts, because if you're listening right now, I think it's a fucking awesome game and you should give it a shot. Uh, nothing really impressive, just a measly 24 damage. Uh, this is, uh, I was going to say, in terms of the scenery, this is like the color, colored sky when you get done with the fight against Elmdor. Like, this is where uh, Malak gets resurrected. Ooh. A Katetsu 204 critical. Ouch. Uh, protect isn't really going to do... So wait, you just subtracted his faith by 20 points? What the hell? Now it makes it even more difficult for him to get hit. Oh my god. Well, that, Oh my... 49 damage, holy! That was actually kind of a smart move. Holy shit. <laughs> wow. Now Fnatic only has 20 faith. And wow, 24 damage punches? Jeez, that is low. That's what happens when you get 40 brave. Wow, I've never seen that. The AI would actually do that intelligently. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's got 25. Oh, no wonder why Dogi C only has 35 faith. And he still got it with his 20, 20 faith. <laughs> Holy shit. That was kind of cool by the monk or whatever. I've never seen uh, Solution be gasted. And why are... Both, God damn it, both, oh no no, I thought both teams were in black for a moment. Nope, one's in blue, one's in black. So, alright. 40% tail is still hanging in, but, oh nope, anti-sandbag. Just putting him right back down in his place. So, yeah, 19%, I want to see if this works. 20 faith against a 35 faith unit. I will laugh if it goes off. No, it doesn't, Oh, But I've never seen that before, I was kind of a shocker. Just looking just looking at it, it seems like as if uh, the bottom team, oh no, no, the top team, I'm just, you saw in the descriptions Team 5 and Team 6, uh, Tacta Goblin did name them, but the full name didn't come out, so I just went accordingly. It looks like Team 5 will be winning this because it is a 3 on 2, no, wow, 4 on, what is it, a 4 on, no, yeah, it's a 4 on 2, and I don't think that those monks can really do it. Not when they both have. 35 brave and 40 brave respectively so kind of dumb for her to use haste too like that but the ai doesn't know so nevertheless a 20 faith 20 faith i've never seen that that is such a shocker i will be amazed if they come back from this but i sincerely doubt it because they're gonna have to deal with that draw wizard who's the person That'll be doing all the damage, and I believe Fnatic is now out of MP, so he'd have to use Chakra if he wanted to keep on casting it. And, oh, the haste went out of way. Looks like a Demi, 53% to a 20 faith unit, that's kind of a lot. And, okay, this, if it combos, nope. Actually, no, because of the regen and move HP up, it will kill, he will survive. And, oh, oh my gosh, <laughs> Fnatic's an atheist, he's got no friggin' faith left. <laughs> yeah, and she changed her mind. Very smart move, but still, I've never seen that solution be casted to a 50 faith. You, uh, I've never seen that before. Never, but draw will kill him. Wow, that was uh, kind of amazing. But all right, I'll see you guys for the next fight between the next two teams, uh, seven and eight.
All right, here we are for the 14th match between teams seven and eight. So on top we have Santos the Monk, Elish the Lancer, Philsov the Oracle, and Walter's Meow the Chemist. Now for teammate we have Lord Bobri the Mediator, Siege and the Monk, Knight, damn it, Malenkin the Monk, and RPG Slave the Geomancer. So it's Philsov's team against Malenkin's team. So. Yeah, uh, the map that we're going to be going to, uh, let me see here. Let's pick a large map for once. We're going to go to the weapon storage of Yardo. Yeah, and god damn it, looks like this is out of focus a little. Like, you, if you look to the very edge of the screen to your left, you'll see a little sliver. Looks like the friggin' uh, screenshot got out of th play or whatever. But anyways, more Rainbow Mew music and the sound effects have been disabled. So, I just think that's a really cool... A set of music you should really try out that game it's fucking awesome it's uber grinding i know i'm not saying much but they're too far away really but yeah it's a it consists of a ton of uber grinding and i think if you're patient enough to play that kind of game it's awesome uh it's tactical just like final fantasy tactics uh it's for playstation 3 that's a psn game you can get for 15 bucks i downloaded the music for five dollars 32 tracks whatever weapon break okay that's pretty good i uh Probably just a coral sword, but nameless dance. Let's see what happens. A stop and a poison. Not the greatest uh, selection she could have got, but at least a stop on Philsob would be very nice. So he won't get move MP up. Battle song, pretty good. Uh, really won't do shit for the Geomancer, except improve her Geomancy skills by a very slight, uh, slight portion. It'll probably do like three damage more, if any because of the formula. Six damage deficit right there. Uh, another 36, not that much really, but that's what you get with a gunshot. Nameless Dance. Okay, no silence on the Oracle. That, that would have uh, just made her useless in terms of casting spells. She would have just been whacking people. MP switch from Lord Bob Bree. A jump on the her. He'll do a good amount of damage. Hamido, nope. The guard. And we're getting some more battle songs, so Melanchthon's just hanging back right now. Siegen can't really do diddly squat. Luckily, her uh, gun hasn't been broken. Okay, oh my god, that was just the freaking kicker that uh, he needed. And a confused unit used remedy, wow. Very lucky. Very lucky on Phil Sob's team's end. Okay, more battle songs, so the knight will probably be formidable in terms of physical offense if she just strikes some- Oh no no, she's got a gun, I forgot. My bad, Siegen's got a gun. Uh, okay, three on, uh, it's a three on four, but it still could go to, uh, Melanchthon's team, if only because of the fact that, of, uh, the nameless dances. Uh, the two stop rocks, the sleeps didn't work unfortunately, and I might have to actually take that back because of the fact that the deadliest unit, the Geomancer, is down, RPG Slave. We'll see though. 105 damage punch, pretty good. From, uh, maybe he could come back from it, we'll see. 75. Unfortunately, there's no more MP for uh, Lord Bob Bree, so he's just gonna have to take damage. Hamido, yeah, that's a free hit right there. And he's dead with a worse compact gunshot. Wow. 96% too. Those are pretty high odds. It's probably good or best compat. Uh, just looking at it, it's kind of over. Because of the fact that... Uh, Charm, yeah. A don't acted unit, the other two are dead. It's pretty much over, it's safe to say. So Phil Sob's team looks like he'll be taking this one. So... Uh, the white supremacists actually uh, are going to be winning this one. So... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. A charge shot for 126. Can't really do anything. So, one more shot, really? Yeah, he's dead after this, uh, after the charge dip. Now, let's just stay here. Hope you're liking this music so far. I kind of mentioned it vaguely in the last video, but it's in an M4A format. It's the new type of compression technique versus MP3. Uh, it's just in a higher quality, I guess. So, yeah, and keep in mind, these are going to be these are produced through Sony Vegas, so they're going to probably take a substantially longer time to uh, create. And yeah, actually next next match, since I didn't think about it until now, you're going to see one little feature, and it might annoy the shit out of you, but uh, I don't think it's the end of the world, so. Yep, just one more hit, and 
Siege will go down. Alright, so with that said, I will be seeing you guys for uh, the next fight between teams. I'm trying to think. Five. No, seven. Yeah, five and seven, I believe. Yeah, so I'll see you in just a moment.